Hey, this is John Glennon of the Tennessee, and we're taking a look ahead to the defensive line position for the Titans in the coming year. Titans made a number of changes at the defensive line during the offseason. Uh, you're looking at guys like Sammy Hill and Antonio Johnson at the defensive tackle spots, Rapati Patoa Tua, and the draft pick LeVar Edwards at the defensive ends. The theme here was a, it was a consistent one. It was about getting bigger uh, because the Titans need to be able to stop the run. Three of those new guys are over 300 pounds. Even LeVar Edwards uh, at 275 is big for a defensive end. So Titans certainly looking to, uh, to stop that run. They finished 24th in the league against the run the past two years. That's got to change. Why? One of the reasons is because it leads to uh, too much time of possession for the other team. Titans were dead last in terms of time of possession last year, second to last the year before. If you can't stop the opponent's running game, if you can't make the other team one-dimensional, you're not going to win the battle of time of possession very often. I think finally what they're looking for on that defensive line, especially in the middle, is more pressure, more of an ability to, to collapse the pocket in the middle. That's going to help out the guys in the end, Derek Morgan and Cam Wimbley. Uh, Derek Morgan had six and a half sacks last year, and he's starting to look like the guy that the Titans picked in the first round a few years ago. Cam Wimbley only had six sacks last year, which was actually the lowest for him in the last four years, but he was still adjusting to a 4-3 position, something that he hadn't played in the last four years.